Hi everybody, it's the Rise Yuki once again giving you guys a new series of tutorials for the Karuda bot, which is a Discord game bot that you can collect characters using cards and reacting to cards. You can also trade characters with your members of your server. For today's tutorial, we're going to go over how to set up the bot for the game and for your server so that you guys can play as well. Let's first go ahead and invite the bot. Let's go ahead and go to our browser here. And what I have for you guys is the actual browser tab for the Karuta bot. It's karuta.xyz and the link will be in the description below so that you guys can get to this. Okay. So let's go back here. So how I set it up is a little bit differently from the Moodip game. The way you actually get your commands is going to be in your DM. To get to your commands, you use the, the prefix is K exclamation mark. And to get the commands, you need to help. The word help. So they're going to em they're going to DM you a command list for you guys. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. So this is the command list, everyone. I will go over today the setup and the information. Each other one will have their own video for you guys to take a look at, okay? So first, let's take a look at some of the commands here. Go back to our, our Karuda bot. So the big one you need to understand is where are your cards going to spawn when somebody uses K-Drop? I have a spawn channel for you, and I did spell it wrong. This would be S-P-A-W-N-S. So that's what the channel is, the channel is. And we're going to use K exclamation mark set. Okay. Now, if you already have a channel for the, for the drops, you need to redo the command again so that they can do it for you guys. So now it says you can now use the K drop command and spawn the drop cards. And automatically, depending on how many the chatters in the server, they're going to drop the cards again at a different interval. Here's the catch. The way they drop the cards for this game is based on how many people are in the server and how many are people chatting chatting in the server automatically, okay, at the same time. So for this server, because it's my test server, it's myself only. But in my mood, in my uh, anime server, I should say, there's 76 usually online at the same time. So there's going to be more spawns in my, in my main server than this one. Now I want to actually give you a drop. Just to show you guys how, it's, how it works. So K and then drop. And then here we go. I'm going to pick one character from A, B, or C, or one, two, or three, so that you guys can take a look at it, okay? I'm going to go number two. I don't care what number two is. All right, so I got uh, I got this one. I got number two, but it's badly damaged. But I'll explain that um, in our in, uh, in future tutorials because there is a system where you guys can repair cards. I will take a look at that later. Okay. If you guys want to change the prefix, use K dot exclamation mark prefix. Okay. The server's custom prefix has been cleared. So K exclamation mark prefix. And then we're going to say K exclamation mark. Okay. So you set the exclamation, K exclamation mark as the prefix. Okay. Keep in mind, remember your other bot as well. Do not use dollar sign because if you use dollar sign, then it's going to confuse with the Moody bot. So I would say dollar sign exclamation mark dollar sign then the commanding if you want to use a dollar sign okay I would keep it as it is though it's K exclamation mark okay chest chest set is a command with dealing with the chest goal we'll talk about that later on because 
as a beginning server for the Ruda bot, it's not going to do much for you guys at the beginning. The next thing we're going to take a look at is anti snipe. Okay, anti snipe. Does anybody remember what other command in the Moody game this is similar to? I guess it's very similar to a Moody game command. And that command is toggle snipe. I believe it was toggle snipe. Where you cannot claim a character for like 30 seconds or so. This one is the same thing, but you can set it. So K anti snipe is going to be like the Moody Games um, character sniping tool. But in this case, you can actually set it by seconds. And in this case, I have two seconds, meaning you cannot claim a character or get a card in this case for two seconds, okay? Dollar, I mean, K exclamation mark permissions will show you your permissions. Okay, you have no disabled commands, and we'll talk about more Moody, more, excuse me, more Karuda bot commands for admins and moderators in a different tutorial later on. We also have S Compensate. This one is for compensation of the game, but we do not have any yet because it's the beginning. Okay, now let's talk about info information commands for you guys. Okay, K cooldowns is going to tell you how many how many minutes you're gonna to have to wait for a grab and a drop. A grab is when you get a character. A drop is when there's going to be a new drop automatically dropping for you guys in the server. So we use K drop, you're doing it by yourself. Okay? But the next drop is 26 minutes before you can drop more card. Okay? Next, reminders. So K reminders. So the daily is ready, the vote is ready, the drop is in 26 minutes, the grab is in 6 minutes, and the work is ready. We'll talk about daily, vote, and work later. But these two you know about in just a, a few minutes ago. Okay? The next one we'll talk about is cart is lookup. Okay? The exclamation mark, lookup. Okay? You're going to look up a card that you have, or let's see if they have a character I know. Yeah, here we go. You can also look up a character's name by typing their name here. Now, I have the name Luna here, but there's a lot. There's a lot of Lunas here, so... Pick one and enjoy it. Enjoy her or something. Okay? There's like 30. There's like 40. So that's what you guys can do as well. Okay? For lookup. It's like the booty bot search or I, I am, if you will. Hard info. Card info, user info, server info, node info, and worker info are very self-explanatory. However, let's take a look at K exclamation mark worker info. So there is some types of work in here as well. We're going to take a look at that later on when we start to talk about the work system. Because there's going to be something we're going to be able to do, okay? And then I'm going to run K exclamation mark server info. And you can grab how many cards for the server that you have, okay? User info is about you. Okay? 
You see, cards burn, cards drop, cards grab, and trades completed. Cards burn is as if you do not want it anymore, okay? We'll talk about that later, okay? And finally, card info is exactly what it sounds like. Okay? That's how it looks like. Okay? But the drop, the, the condition is random though. That's the thing. It's random. Okay, so we're gonna go into we're gonna go into more of the condition, the cards, the trade, and future tutorials, alright? But that's how you guys start the move the Karuda bot. If you guys have any questions about the Karuda bot, I will I will be able to answer beginning questions only at this time. When we get into future tutorials, then you can ask me questions about the damage, the the conditions and all that. But for now, that is all I have for you guys today. Um tomorrow we will have a live Moody bot tutorial and we're gonna be doing it on how to play. So if you guys are interested, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and all of that good stuff. We're gonna have a tutorial, live tutorial of Mood a bot, and we're gonna learn how to play, okay? See you guys tomorrow morning at around 9.15 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, that's not, that's 12.15 Eastern. That's all for now. We'll see you guys soon.